Hey guys and welcome. For today's video, I'm going to be doing the Huda Beauty wear test for today. So if you guys are interested in seeing how it goes, just stay tuned and let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so for today's video, um, I'm going to be doing the Huda Beauty wear test. So I'm just going to go ahead and put on the Huda Beauty foundation in front of you guys. So you'll actually see like I am putting on the Huda Beauty foundation and nothing else. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys me putting on the foundation. But as far as all the rest of my makeup, I'm going to do that off camera. And then I'm going to come back once I get all the rest of my makeup finished up. So let's just go ahead and get started. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with my primer. And I did do an unboxing and a um, beauty, no, the foundation wear, putting it on my face. I did a video for that, so if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. But I'm going to go ahead and do this wear test for today. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with the primer here, the Huda Beauty Foundation Primer. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and put this on my face. Alrighty, so now I got the primer all blended in, mixed in, rubbed in. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Beauty Blender brush and go ahead and go in with my, my Huda Beauty foundation. And something that I didn't mention in my last video is this makeup does seem to oxidize into your skin. So like when it starts to warm up, it starts to blend in much better with my skin tone. So when I first put it on, it just looks much darker than my actual skin tone. As you can tell from my face and my neck, it does look a little, you know, like not my shade. But then after a few minutes, it just starts to blend in more with my skin that I noticed in my last video I did. So now that I got this foundation on, I'm going to go ahead and do my highlights and all that other good stuff, you know, that us women love to do. So I will be right back once I get done beating the rest of my face. Beating the rest of my face. Okay. <laughs> but I will be back when I get done doing the rest of my face and I will show y'all the finished product. All right. And you know us ladies love to bake. And we are finished. So this is the final look. And I must say, the foundation does blend very good. It blends very well with my skin type. All right, so the time now is 3.17. As you can see, 317. So I will be back later on tonight and I'm just gonna be showing y'all like how the makeup did throughout the rest of today and if it did good or if it did not do good. So I guess we will see when I get back. So, all right, I'll see you guys later. All right, guys, and I'm back, and it's been about, let's say, I think like seven, no, I think six hours. Yeah, so it's been about six hours since I put on my foundation, so the time now, it is currently... So, it's been a pretty, you know, long day, decent day. So let's just go ahead and get on to the foundation and how did it hold up today. So as you can see, it held up pretty freaking good. And I have oily skin. So usually with my other foundation, like if I wear that just for like maybe like 
four 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 or five hours like my it's already starting like my oil is already starting to like to produce and you can see it but with this here i don't really have a whole lot of oil build up so let me just get up close and then zoom in for you guys so you can see like on my forehead you know it's just slightly like shiny but i did i did do highlight up here on my forehead too a little bit so that could be what it is but as far as like a lot of like oil build up like it's really like hardly any so and there is some one part i did notice around where my smile lines are at it did start to like just crease just a little bit though but that's just a little bit so i don't know if you guys can see that look around here look around there I mean, yeah like right there so i mean it's not too too bad you know so i mean overall that's not too bad for six hours i want to say it's bad at all because you can't really see it unless you're like like this in my face you know which nobody should be that close to my face but um yeah for the most part i give this foundation about a nine like i, I think it's freaking amazing i think it's good so you know just minus this little crease here which i feel like it may become a deeper crease like further in the day with more hours i feel like it could get a little worse but i mean just for like six hours like that's you know okay it's not too too bad so yeah i'll give this foundation about a nine so i would like this foundation you know it held up pretty well so that covers everything for this video um if you guys enjoyed this video just give it a thumbs up i'm gonna try and do other more foundation videos or you know anything that you guys would like to see you can comment below and just let me know what else y'all would like to see if you would like to see a tutorial or whatever the case may be just let me know down below and also you can also subscribe to this channel as well and be strictly of me with beauty and all that good stuff that women love so until next time and i will see you guys later Alrighty. Mwah. Peace.